The WGN Morning Show has been the most watched morning program for more than a dozen years. Actually, probably a couple dozen years. Yeah. Partially for its extensive news coverage, but also for the laughs that gets us up and rolling in the morning. As we continue to celebrate 75 years on the air, Paul Conrad and Pat Thomasula are joining us this morning. Thanks for coming in, guys. Oh, thanks oh, for having it's us. our pleasure. Yeah, Welcome to Studio here. One, Pat. You've been here before. Yeah, I've been here many times. Paul, yeah, this, this is, is uh, first your first time, yeah, time it's here. It's beautiful it's delightful. here. Well, it's all bright you. and shiny. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's really nice. Good for you. <laughs> Thanks for coming in. Thank you, sure, guys. Yeah. All right, so you've been here 27 years? Coming up on 27, yeah. Wow. This August, yeah, forever. Wow. You know, when you first get hired here, you think, ah, if I make it a year or two, I'll be lucky. Mm -hmm. Then all of a sudden, you're at 25, 26 years. It's crazy. Yeah, you're like, where'd the time all go? Right, and when you started, I started working here, all the people that had been working here had been here for 20, 25 years. Uh, yeah. Like, How are you doing this? And you just stick around long yeah. enough. It's not like cheese. Yeah. <laughs> eventually, it doesn't matter if it's moldy. You just it's you love better. to eat it, yeah. though. The, yeah. the longer it's here, the better it tastes. So let's talk about the show when it first started. I'm always interested. When they come to you and they say, let's do this crazy off-the-wall kind of show, not typical. I mean, what were you guys thinking about it? Because I know you joined later in, Pat. But yeah, I was 2005. Yeah, I think uh, I was I was originally when the show was first to be put on the air, I was in the running for the original weather position. Okay. I was working over at this shop called CLTV. <laughs> which, yeah. But they decided it was a little too much sexy to hit morning viewers yeah. immediately, yeah. so they said, let's hold off a little bit right. and see let's if he gets it. less right. better looking right. as yeah. he gets older. Right, which was smart on Didn't their part. Didn't happen, though. No, I, yeah. I, I keep going up. But I watched it, so I was then took a job in Tampa, Florida, and I would watch the show from Tampa. And I was like, this is an interesting show at times, like, especially <laughs> yeah. like the... Maybe two years, the second year of it, it just became more interesting. And I found myself watching because I'm like, ah, something unpredictable might happen on this. And to me, that's what's been good about this show is that there are these moments that are actually unpredictable. Yes. And so I always thought, oh, I'd like to be a part of that. So then uh, some circumstances changed. They hired me here in 1996. And to me, I've always liked that there's been some freedom to break some of the rules that you typically see. Oh, you see guys in break them all down. To me, that's the only thing that's interesting. Well, and for both of you, because you guys are both quite comic relief on the show in the morning, has it ever gotten to your point you're like, I wonder if that was too far? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Not so much. I've been told it's been oh, okay. too far. <laughs> yeah. Have I ever gone home and said, boy, I shouldn't have done or said that? I don't know. Maybe a handful, yeah. but I can't. I, yeah. I can't think of any one thing. Even the one thing that, that, we're that all I really. Oh, that we're all yeah. thinking about with the uh, North guy that lives at the North Pole. Listen. Yeah. Sixty percent of the people who reached out to me said it was the funniest thing they've ever seen on TV. So it wasn't all wrong. Right. In hindsight, would I do it again? Probably not. Yeah. Hey, haters are just fans that don't know it yet. Listen, yeah. I made a lot of people's lives better that day. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 And the two of you all. Make people's lives better is a lot of that thank scripted. you for acknowledging that yes. Yes. Awesome. Not, they don't we tell us that overlooked. enough <laughs> overlooked yeah. all the time and it's not nice to have us. somebody who appreciates us yes. and who verbalize it yes. but, not not yeah. but is a lot of that scripted i mean courtesy does yeah, well, you no, know really. no, you know I mean, when here's, you, when here's the truth i don't know how to use the computer <laughs> system here right so i couldn't even edit a yeah. script if i wanted to <laughs> so everything for me is ad lib yeah i mean i write my uh i write my sports scripts with uh my producer and we pick the stuff that goes into sports but anything outside of that no i don't i don't script anything now so you're originally from new york right jersey jersey sorry yeah. to jersey yeah did you ever think you were going to be here this long <laughs> no <laughs> no i th you know i th you think how it goes is like this like you start this is for me at least when you are bouncing around in the tv business you think you're going to be at each place you know two, two three years, years yeah. until you go until you're at network but then when I started to realize, like, the longer I was here, and there were times where I would have opportunities to, like, I did a show on ABC, yeah, the yeah. network, and I would tape pilots and do this and that. And it was like those, it, it drove me nuts. Because yeah. you would be in these meetings, and you would have a writer's meeting. It's like, I was on a show with Shaquille O'Neal where oh. you wrote the dopiest copy, and you were on camera for three minutes out of an hour. And there would be nine people in a writer's room, oh, no. like three of them executives. And you get to a point where you appreciate this place, they let us do 
whatever we want. <laughs> Nobody is breathing down our neck. Like the idea of like being on Good Morning America with yeah. people telling you what color Covering, tie you yes. could wear. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. All the money in the world yeah. could not get me to do that. And we'd for... be fired if we were a good morning. <laughs> we would be fired every week. Yeah, I would suspect. Um, so you get to a point where it's like you you really do like a pr like this is unlike any any show in in television news. Yeah. I remember Greg Caputo when he was the news director made a comment that the morning show was like the Friends cast. It's an ensemble right. that <laughs> you can't just randomly replace one person and make sure that it'll work. Yeah, yeah. So how do you, I mean, all of this come together. Yeah, I think it's probably one of the better <laughs> things also, though, is like if you think, if you can't stand Larry because he's an uptight <laughs> jerk, you know, you can like somebody else, yeah. right? Or you may, hypothetically speaking. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. <laughs> or you may love Pat, but you can't stand uh, Anna, right? Like you'll find somebody on there yeah. that you can relate with and like. Uh, and. I, I always feel like we're all at some point or another expendable and we'll yeah. be replaced no, by somebody. No, no, no. I will say too, like, you know, I'm not, like management over the years, I got to give them credit too because yeah. they really have had very few misses yeah. on yeah. that show, right? Yeah. You think yeah. of all the people who've come and gone yeah. and, and even the people who didn't work out, it's not like they were bad at their job. Right. No, they yeah. were really good and went on to do great things. This just wasn't a fit for them. But 80% of the time, they... They've, they do yeah, pretty well. They've done it well. Yeah. yeah. It shows so much fun to watch oh, yeah, for all these stinkers. years. I'll name some names if yeah. you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not touching that one. Yeah. 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 hanging on, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, gentlemen, thank you for coming for on. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there's more tacos over there, but stay. Right. We have cocktails next. Oh, yeah. lovely. All right. <laughs> oh. Neither one of them drink, I think. Yeah. 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 He does, but he's yeah. a big drinker. <laughs> he's got some you. constitution. Yeah, I've got a great constitution. Yeah. That I've seen. Eastern Ooh. Europeans, I'm proud of. Man, yeah. <laughs> you can see them every morning, everybody, from 6 to 10, so check them out.